everyone, Sarah here with Rustic Room Crafts. I got asked to go ahead and do a quick video on how I upload images from Google into Cricut Design Space to create my own um, somewhat SVG to go ahead and cut out an image. So I'm going to go ahead and search Mama Bear. That's what I want to make today. And if you go to images, you can look around and find the one you want. I know the more um, like famous one is the one with the tent and design. So I'm trying to find something similar to that, if not that. Um, and then I also want to recommend, make sure you check your group, if you're in a Facebook group for Cricut, check their files first. A lot of people share um, their images with you on your groups, so that's a really great resource, so you don't even have to hunt through Google, you can just go ahead and do that. So I'm going to go ahead and, hmm, I personally like, I think I just want to do the bear. I think I'm gonna do this one in my Cricut group. Save. Okay. So now you're gonna go to Cricut Design Space. Um, I already went to File, New Project, and now I went to the side on the left right here, and I'm uploading this image. So if I go to my file where I saved it and click Mama Bear. It's gonna pull it into Cricut Design Space. And then you just select, select a moderately complex image. And here, this is where people um, mess up. They just hit continue. And if you do this, you're not going to be left with a cut image. You have to go to select and erase and erase the white or any background images that you don't want to show. If this had some verbiage down at the bottom, I would want to go ahead and erase that as well. Uh, make sure you zoom in so you can hit all the tiny spots because we want those to cut out as well whenever we're using our vinyl. I don't know if I'm hitting all of these. And then just kind of give it a look over and make sure you got everything. And then you're going to hit continue, save as a cut if that's what you're wanting to do. And then I normally name mine um, over here so I can search it because this is always going to be in your image resource under your um, Cricut. So it's easier to search. And then here's where you'll find all of them, or anytime you go to um, insert an image at the top, you can just search the tag you used and it will pop it up now along with all of the images Cricut has to offer. So that's how you get an image from Google into Cricut Design Space. If you have any questions, please go ahead and leave them in the comments and thanks for watching. That's cute. Um, I think I already have this image saved, but if not, I'm going to go ahead and just save it in here. Oh, no. Try again. Save image.